Hey guys, uh, welcome to Savable Week 7. So last week's entries, we had a replay, a savable replay from Budsy that needed to be edited from frame 160, I believe it was. Correct me if I'm wrong. But here we have some um, interesting replays. Most people went for the straight up DQ. Although I was looking for uh, people trying to get a DM. I couldn't even get a DM myself, but I mean, I'm putting this task onto you guys, so... I was hoping I'd get a few DMs. A few of you actually did get some awesome ones. I was surprised because it was a freaking nightmare getting DMs in this. Saving in this was otherwise very easy and simple. Basically, I gave those uh, of you who kind of like just need that extra little push to get into this event. And this event was pretty easy to do. It was This replay was kind of easy to save. All you had to do was basically just save yourself from the floor and then just lift up. And then you could go anywhere from there. Um, but for the next two weeks, you guys are going to suffer. <laughs> I'm not even joking, you guys are going to suffer so hard because, oh my god. Dude. The next replay is also made by Budsy and OMG, you guys are going to die. Because the first one includes a double save where you literally need to save twice or you're going to die. But it's going to be very fun, I'm looking forward to it a lot. I have my own replay already made, it's going to be interesting. I have to wait for a week until I can upload it, but um, damn. So let's... Let's see, some people got some really cool stuff going here. I I really like the people who got some DMs here. I think the only three or four people who actually managed to get a DM or two off of uh, Yuke here. Some people did flips like that, which was really cool. I like the idea of the, the whole flip and throwing Yuke out of the ring. It was really, really unique and different and like just fun and people taking the save to a, a kind of like a new level. Uh, presumably because they couldn't get a D DM or anything like that. But yeah, it's pretty fun. Uh, Gas tank probably has the best throw out because it's like just so swift and then kabam, which I just love how swift that was. But other than that, I'm trying to get the replays, the savable replays where it's kind of like hard to do so that less people enter. I don't want really like just kind of like quick save stuff. It's kind of boring. I want people to outdo themselves and practice and actually kind of develop new ideas for saving and like different methods you can do this. I mean all of you guys made like a replay and you're probably thinking okay that was probably the only approach and there's gonna be hundreds of people with your same replay. But if you watch this you'll notice that everybody does something different. There are some people who do vaguely similar kinds of ideas and stuff and like kind of execute it the same way as others in a in a one way or another but then there are a lot of people who try very very unique cool different types of replays. It's kind of surprising to see that there's just this many ways to save one simple replay. It's kind of cool as well. Yeah, but generally, everyone generally went for the butt to the ground kind of approach where you just get his ass like DQ'd like that, which is kind of a little bit boring, but but I mean, it is technically a save and you guys still get to be in the video, so that's fine too. If, if you can't do better, then it's fine. If if you don't have time to, that's fine too. Just, just sometimes try to be unique and, and test your skills. So for our notable replays, we have Budsy2727 somehow getting this leg into a position is like, which kind of seems impossible to get to. She gets that left leg behind Yuke's head, decaps him like it was so easy to get there in the first place. I mean, I tried this myself, it was like impossible to do. So yeah, I'm the boss one is up next and basically he has like a fracture then it kicks off the arm, which is really sweet. I love how smooth and quickly it goes. Unfortunately, he isn't able to get the decap, but I tried this myself, it's hard to get this decap, but that leg coming up was perfect, taking the arm, and he wins by points, GG. So for next week, we have this replay by Budsy, which you can download from the link in the description. You have to edit it at frame 260. As you can see, you've lost your head, your head is falling to the ground, so you gotta save your head, and then save the momentum which your whole body's flying out the ring with. This is going to be a little bit tricky to do, but I hope some of you can get it and do some unique stuff. It's going to be really fun.